Hello, and thank you for joining us for yet another wonderful Lightline webinar. We will be taking your questions at the end of the presentation. There is a space for you to ask questions. Today we are going to talk about small aperture fixtures, pri primarily recessed lights. Uh, small aperture fi fixtures provide a very big impact. Uh, small aperture recessed fixtures provide drama and big impact. You can use them for accent lighting, general lighting. Uh, small aperture fixtures can do a lot with great style. Uh, the downlight families that we're going to talk about today are the micro LEDs, the micro pots, Luna 2, Sigma 2, and Helios 2, and then we're going to introduce the Helios 3. The micro LEDs, which are one of, I'm going to bring this really close to the screen, it's one of our smallest uh, fixtures. Um, it's available as a single. It can be recessed or surface mounted. It's 1.2 watts. It delivers up to 106 lumens and 24 volt driver, remote driver is added to it. The fixtures are available in white, a matte white, a flat white, an anodized black, which is beautiful, and the brushed aluminum, which is really spectacular. We offer these fixtures in 27K, 3000K, and 5000K, 5500K, sorry. The 5500 is primarily used uh, for jewelry stores. We offer four different beam angles in the micro LED, 15 degrees, 30 degrees, 45 degrees, and 60 degrees. And I wanna show it to you again. The fixture can be surface mounted, or it can become a recessed fixture. It's very flexible. In that same family of micro LEDs, we also offer them in a gimbal installation, and we call these our little mini multiples. And you can see we have a single, a double, a triple, a linear quad, or a square quad. The micro LEDs can be used in a lot of really very interesting applications, not just nowhere. They can be, as you can see in this image here, they can be used in a star ceiling, especially if you order the fixture in black with the black ceiling, it looks terrific. It can go into drywall, it can go into millwork. It has a lot of applications. Uh, we see it used for displays, we see it used to like trotch skis. Um, we also see it used in uh, drywall, and it's a wonderful little fixture that can be used in many different applications. The Micropot is our slightly larger fixture. It has a uh, one and a half inch aperture. It is a recessed fixture that comes with an IC rated housing. It provides really quality illumination. Uh, it can be used as an accent light. It can be used in hallways. It can be used in multifamilies in hallways where it's just lighting the number to the unit or the door to the unit. Um, it can be used in restaurants, millwork, showcases, cabinetry. It's also great. I've used it in wine cellars. Any kind of niche application works. The Micropot is a 3.5 watt fixture. It delivers 235 lumens. It's available in 3000K. You can have it in white, black, or silver. It's available in both round and square. Uh, the, they're both wonderful little fixtures. The square light puts out a little square beam. It's, it's adorable. Um, it's a 24 volt dimmable driver that goes to these fixtures and it's definitely suitable for insulated ceilings. The next downlight family we're going to talk about is the Luna 2 and as you know our entry-level fixtures are the Luna 2. 
and the Luna family. And the Luna 2 fixture is a small two inch fixture. The aperture really is, I have to lift this so you can see. The aperture really is an inch and a quarter and it's available in both round and square. It's seven watts, providing up to 560 lumens. It's offered in 90 CRI. It is CCT selectable. And as you can see here, you can select your color temperature by just moving along the selectability switch in the back. Now, this fixture is wet rated. It's IC rated. It's Energy Star. It meets Title 24. We offer a lifetime warranty with it. It's both a remodel and new construction. We also offer it, besides the static white, we offer it in dim to warm that goes from 2000K all the way up to 3000K. There are several dimming options available. The standard unit is ELV triactable. Now, the next family we're going to talk about is our Sigma 2 family, and that's definitely a step up from our Luna family, it gives you a lot more options. So in our Sigma family, we have a lot of beautiful European styling trims that are small aperture with a small profile. Now, let's start with what we can deliver for lumens. We can offer 700 lumens in static white, 1100 or 1600. The 900 lumens is available in dim to warm. The fixtures are available in both IC and non-IC. We offer 15 degree beam, a 24 degree beam, a 40 degree beam, and a 50 degree beam. You can purchase the Sigma 2 family in both trimmed and trimless. We also offer the Precision Pro option. The trims are all available in white or black flanges. Uh, again, we have static color temperatures here, not color selectable because that gives you more lumens. And we offer 27K, 3000K, 3500, 4000, 5000, and again, dim to warm in 2000 all the way up to 3000. Now, as you can see, we offer a very large array of trims, both round and square. Some of them are adjustable, some of them are not. Some options are wet location, some options are not. We also offer wonderful little multiples in the, in the Sigma 2. So a single, a double, and a triple. Um, I'm going to talk next about two fixtures that are new to the Sigma 2 family and that would be the deep regress, then we'll talk about the wall washer. Um, if you uh, look at our cut sheets, we offer a brand new Sigma 2 deep regress fixture. That fixture has the LEDs sitting really high up in the fixture. It provides a very, for very quiet ceiling. Um, the illumination coming out of it, it looks super, super quiet. Um, again, it's offered in white and black. We offer a 15 degree, a 24 degree, and a 40 degree. Um, we offer it in round and square, black, and white. Uh, some of our trims that come with this particular fixture are a little bit different than the rest of the Sigma 2 family. So we have a high gloss white. Even the high gloss white is super quiet in the ceiling. We have an onyx, which is lovely. It kind of reminds you of the deep Alzac of old. It behaves the same way. We offer a gold, a beautiful copper, a specular, and a semi-specular. This fixture is wet location rated, so it can be used indoors and outdoors. Again, 27K, 3000K, 3500, 4000, and 5000K. The Sigma 2 wall washer is probably one of the best in class when it comes to wall washers. Um, it's a really neat little wall washer. It can illuminate 
the wall very nicely and evenly and it provides for light on the floor as well so you can use it to highlight artwork to highlight texture you know to wall wash texture on a wall or just use it as the lighting in the hallway this fixture goes up to a thousand lumens and it's available in all the standard colors now we're moving into the helios two and three family and really this family was created to give you all the control you want in a recessed light so when we're talking about helios whether it's the helios two or the helios three you we are giving you the ultimate control of optical performance of your recessed fixture the fixture provides beautiful illumination and it starts in the Helios 2 at a thousand lumens. If you go to the Helios 3, then you can work your way up to 1800 lumens. The Helios family provides up to a 40 degree angle so that you can aim at the wall and we have a 365 rotation on the collar so it allows you to go in all directions. We also provide a six millimeter drift so that when the fixture is angled, it can keep uh, the light centered in the middle of the trim. So you can select from five different beam angles. We offer a 15 degree, a 28 degree, a 36 degree, a 45 degree, and a 55 degree. It it comes with a beautiful reflector that um, has a lot of options. So please look at our options. They are all lovely. So let's talk a little bit about how the fixture comes together. We have our carrier case and the front collar are two separate pieces as you can see here. And then our light engine can slip in there. You have a choice of internal optics right here and external optics. So when you look at the cut sheet, don't be confused. Just go back to this picture, internal optics, external optics. And then we have an array of both trimmed and trimless reflectors to go with this fixture. So the fixture itself, I'm going to show you right here. Um, once you aim it, the mechanical aiming is from below, and you can use an electric screwdriver to do that. And you can choose to aim it before you put it in the ceiling or after you put it into the ceiling. But we have a spring-loaded mechanism, so you can aim it below the ceiling, slide it back into place, and pop it into the ceiling, and it'll go back to where you aim the fixture to. Um, the adjustable mounting clips will open up uh, audit, you know, with a screwdriver and it'll hold the fixture in the ceiling Oops, beautifully. Now, we in the Helios family, we allow for three positions for the fixture to sit in the ceiling. So if you take a look, um, the lowest, we have the height of the lowest position, and then you can pop the unit up higher and higher so that you can make for a beautifully quiet ceiling. And so the Helios 3 is new to the Helios family. It's going to be available in 1,000, 1,400, and 1,800 lumens. It is available as trimmed or trimless. It has a wall washer option. Both the Helios 2 and the Helios 3 have wall washer options. They are IC rated. They're available in Triac, ELV, and 0 to 10 dimming. We also offer a tunable white, and you can choose the type of driver you want with that. But we also offer Kasambi control for the tunable white. And um, you'll see our cut hole size is available on our cut sheets, but for the three inch, the cut hole size is three and three quarters. The other option, the other thing you need to know 
about our cut sheets. We are starting to offer TM30 uh, information on our cut sheets so that you know what you're dealing with as far as fixtures are concerned. The other thing that we offer, um, and you need to come and come to us and ask for, is we offer a trim list for wood ceilings in our Helios family. So if you have an application where you need that, uh, please feel free to call your local um, agent and they'll be able to help you with that or call us directly at the factory. Uh, please let us know if you have any questions.